Good evening everybody, how are you today? This evening actually, it's this evening. I am filming in my studio, um, I've been doing some listings, I've been doing some sorting, some tidying and things like that. So I'm going to show you a few items that I think my customers will be looking for uh, right now and I think this will be helpful to you guys too. Uh, the seasons will be changing, I know it's been quite a warm October but summer is actually not officially over yet until the 31st I believe. They will be getting cold and snappy soon so like I said I'm going to show you a few bits that I, I pulled out ready to uh, list uh, I want to show you them so hopefully you find it really interesting so first of all I'm going to show you Ooh. Okay. so the first piece is a vintage piece and um, this is rather fabulous it's a 1980s western style uh, party shirt which is long enough to be um, a shirt dress actually so I just want to show you it's not buttoned up but how pretty is that so it's very evening um, I'm sure somebody, um, some of my customers would wear this during the day, um, especially if they're from London or Birmingham or someone like that, but this is definitely more of an evening piece. Um, it can be worn as a dress, like I said, with a belt, some heels or whatever, or they will layer it over um, a dress or uh, some jeans on the top. Um, it's in pretty good condition for the age. There are a few missing sequins, especially on the back. Um, I don't know whether it's worth replacing those, even though it would be very easy to replace them. Um, it's a very common sequin. But I think it's beautiful. This one cost me four pounds. Um, I thought it was really good. Can you see the moons on there? Um, so, yes, yeah, so you need to be looking out for sheer. It's very 90s. Um, oversized slouchy shirts, sequins, especially for uh, the winter seasons for parties and things like that, or generally just going out. Um, so that's something you should be looking out for to list. So again, on a similar vein, I've got this item that I've already listed, but I thought I'd show you anyway. It is a Past Times ladies trophy jacket. Um, Past Times uh, went into administration quite a number of years ago now, thinking about it. Uh, so they no longer are around but their pieces are still quite popular because they were um, antique inspired items and this item was an art deco inspired jacket so as you can see it's very art deco the colours are wonderful it's navy and gold and like an ox blood and it's on like a burgundy silk and it is fully lined and as you can see it actually has its original sequins and tags there so this is a nice piece um, I think I think I may have paid somewhere in the region about £6 for this. Um, I, I'm holding out for a high item um, price for this. Uh, so I'm confident someone will buy it, but especially around the season. So that's why I picked it up to show you guys. You need to be looking out for these beautiful jewel coloured items that people can wear in the evening. So on talking about jewel colours, I have these beautiful uh, two pieces. Um, this is a vintage uh, Edinburgh collection from the Edinburgh Centre of Edinburgh Mill, but I don't think I, I think I'm making that up. No, it's Edinburgh collection, so it's obviously not the same thing. But it's a beautiful um, liquid satin fuchsia jeweled coloured shirt. Um, these items are highly desirable ladies buy these throughout the year, but these colours, particularly uh, during the autumn winter times, are very popular. Or, um, evening wear. They look very nice with teamed up with diamonds or whatever. Um, yes, a lot of the more mature ladies like them, but currently the trends are uh, things like velvet or satin um, are currently very popular with bloggers at the moment. Um, you just need to look on Pinterest. If you're not already on Pinterest, I do re recommend you going on there. Um, it'll give you lots of free information about what is trendy and what people are following. So yes, so this is a nice piece, this is a size 10. As you can see, it's like a boyfriend cut, so it's baggy, um, very loose. These are nice uh, tucked into uh, disco jeans or a pencil skirt, depending on how old you are. Um, yeah, so that's one piece. A really nice uh, fuchsia dress here. Now, please look out for these uh, pencil galaxy dresses. 
Galaxy dresses um, were initially invented by Ronan Moray. Um, he invented the original, or designed the original Galaxy dress, followed by uh, Victoria Beckham. She did a few, because she used to wear the Ronan Moray before she started her, started her own uh, label. So um, it was very flattering in all shapes, so whether you're pencil thin, Audrey Hepburn pencil thin, or whether you're curvaceous like beaded on tees, Everyone wears galaxy dresses when they want something easy to wear that's going to be sexy and attractive and feminine. Um, and this one is a really nice example. This is like new uh, from Dorothy Perkins. It's a size 10. Um, I paid, I think I only paid a pound for this. Um, yes, it's only a pound. Um, but because the colour and the fact that it is a galaxy dress, I'm confident I'll be uh, selling this one quite quickly. So florals are not just for spring and summer. So here is a really nice example of an autumnal colour palette. Um, so it's all navy blue with like um, beige and like green earthy tones, uh, rust red, a little bit of purple there. Um, so these patterns, this particular one is actually like a long shirt. It's long like a dress, it's like a smock, but it is a shirt. Um, so, so it's to be worn over something, maybe, maybe a, a mini dress again. Um, this is a vintage piece, uh, probably early 90s looking at the fabric. Um, yeah, so the reason why I'm showing you this is particularly for the pattern and the colourway. Um, look out for these autumnal colours. Florals are always um, desirable. So in late November, December, Burns Night is a really big being in Scotland and North of England, Durham side of things. Uh, Burns Night is also a fancy dress, uh, a healing sort of brand that's quite comical. A brand, you know what I mean, theme. Um, but tartan, autumn winter time tartan is majorly, majorly in demand. And I managed to find this lovely example of a, a 90, it's probably late 80s, early 90s tartan blazer with the red, green colourway and it's got these lovely heavy military inspired um, metal gold buttons. Everything is really neat and tidy. Um, blazers at the moment are all the rage, especially with Mark Balmain um, with the uh, military style jackets. Um, they've made the gold button blazer thing very, very popular. So um, this hits two fashions or two trends in one. Got the gold button blazer and the tartan. In fact, Balmain has actually just released a tartan version of their own. So, if you have anything tartan, um, do get it listed now because there will be people um, wanting a tartan blazer. Okay, so this is going to be listed ASAP. So, in winter, people are after the quality fabrics, uh, so like merino wool. Uh, pure lamb's wool and obviously cashmere and camel. Um, here is a lovely uh, cardigan by Esthemi Cashmere. So it is a cashmere brand. Um, this is pure cashmere. It's black. It's perfect. It's a boyfriend cut with pockets. This one is actually a cardigan. And if I haven't already mentioned this, uh, so get your cashmere pieces listed straight away. If they are holy or beyond repair, you can actually um, lock them off and sell them as damaged and there are actually people who buy damaged cashmere because they like to recycle it. So even if you have damaged cashmere, pure that is, pure cashmere, do get that listed because someone will actually buy it anyway. So here we have um, a nice piece here. These kind of dresses are popular with, especially with more mature ladies or the ones that are not too confident with their figures. These are very flattering and they hide all sorts of sins um, underneath, well, what's underneath this. Um, the fabric is really, really nice, but why I'm showing you this is it's like a really fun, bright, vivid petrol blue on black and mild grey. And it's got a fun, like, designer-inspired print. But it's also embellished. Um, these are ideal party pieces again. Also, um, they're nice career pieces, so especially if they have parties during the uh, November, December time, and they want to go from straight from work for drinks, after work drinks, this is a perfect dress. So these type of dresses with this print and design are going to be in demand. 
And here's another example of something that you should be looking out for and getting listed. It's polka dot or pin dot. Uh, pin dot is a very, very fine dot. Um, this is a good example because it's actually satin as well. Um, but yes, this one's by Reese. It's a nice shirt. This is more like a dress shirt or a career shirt. Um, but yeah, polka dot. Um, polka dot skirts will sell very quickly, especially the navy or black pin dot skirts and shirts. They sell very well at the moment. And finally, this one's a bit of a fun one. Uh, these sell quite well. If you can get hold of the originals, it's really good, but um, I don't know whether you realize, but camouflage print is all the rage at the moment, thanks to the Kardashians mainly, a little bit of Rihanna, but mainly the Kardashians. These oversized, huge coats, um, Chloe and Kylie, they're all wearing them. So this is an original army um, coat, jacket, and um, it's got the British flag on this one. You can get them from all sorts of countries, but if you can find these pieces relatively cheaply, if I can show you, this was only a pound. So uh, yeah, get, definitely get them listed. Um, the young ones especially, uh, the young women and more the fashion aware people, they will be buying these straight, uh, straight away. So vintage is better, so the original is better. Um, you will be competing with uh, fashion, fashion-y style ones, but some people generally just genuinely want the genuine product and they want to dress it up how they want to. So yeah, look out for camouflage. That goes for the trousers as well, um, but mainly the coats, the coats will sell. Um, and if you can embellish them with, if you've got any vintage brooches or anything, you can always put them onto the jacket and sell as a whole. So the jacket with brooches. Um, I might do that actually, it's a good idea, Victoria. Oh, I'm glad you thought of that. Yeah, so that's that. Well, I hope you found that interesting. I always like to watch um, haul videos and things like that. Um, but seeing as I um, specialise in eBay and selling on eBay, I thought um, a small haul showing you what kind of things I will be listing uh, for the, the upcoming seasons um, would be helpful to you and um, you can look out for yourself and hopefully make some pennies for you. Um, I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, um, please do press like. Um, if you want to see more videos of me, you can subscribe and you will be um, alerted if you press the bell on the bottom of the video. Um, if there's anything that, um, anything you want to say, say hello to me, you're more than welcome to leave comments. If there's any pieces that you particularly liked or if you want any advice on anything, um, please do pop a comment below and I will try to get to you as soon as possible. You can also get hold of me and follow me on Instagram, um, it's Chasing Secrets Boutique, all one word, and uh, you'll find me there and um, maybe we can make friends. So um, I hope to speak to you boys and girls soon and bye!